Welcome, Man, funny. welcome, boys. How we doing? Come on, jump in. We here. We here. <laughs> we back. <laughs> Yo. Good lies, golf. He's like, <laughs> yeah. We're here. Brandon wiped away my smoke, dude. What a disrespectful move, man. Got a fucking oh, mat in here, bro. Oh, God. That's so good. Wiping yeah. mats out of my face. We're here, dude. We got we got Charles Schwab. We got PGA Championship. We got Tyson. Dude, we got Scott. What a weekend. We got, got what through a weekend. weekend. It got through. Got through. What a weekend. Woo. Wow. Roller Talk coaster. about intensity. Roller coaster, dude. man. That was a great major, I thought, man. I mean, oh, I think it was the, one of the best the... in so long. Listen, we've been chatting Xander up for how long about being consistent? It's about time. I mean, he finally, about time. Put the nail on the coffin, bro. He did it, and that was it. Thank God. Well, he's been working. Too. He's been yeah, working like tough. an Amish guy yeah, churning butter, dude. That guy's yeah. been working nonstop. And came I'm glad in that hot. He finally, came in hot and won came it. Came in hot, bro. Wow. Shout out well to that Well deserved. Guy. Well deserved. Yeah, it was only a matter of time. Yeah, dude. Maybe he's gearing up. Maybe you know. Maybe he's trying to defend his title at the Olympics. You know, man. He's getting into shape. He just got his big major under his belt. You know, he finally got over that hump. And this might know. be the year of, of of guys getting over that that hump. Fleetwood's next. <laughs> yeah, get yeah. over that hump, bro. All these oh, second man. and third place guys, they, they're all itching money. for one. Yeah, yeah. He does love his money, though. He's winning some money. Now, that was it's, good to see, man. Good that was them, a hell man. of a tournament. I mean, the way it finished, awesome. everything, I mean, about it, even how she Bryson. Even how, how Scheffler just started everything with the weekend, with, <laughs> you know, with the drama and the news. But even, like, Shoffley shooting a major record. I mean, come on. Shane Lowry. 62 is just diesel. Lowry. A lot was He going tied on. it, but yeah. almost beat it. Yep, Dude, Lowry. That was... And you know, I was I was rooting for our guys. Shane I was talking too. about was... Larry because that long ball. We were both talking. Yeah. You know, I was Brendan's boy. I said Larry's is coming up. What you a know, week, he's... though! What a lot of yeah. golf, man. That was wild. That was a good one. And hey, we owe an apology, or I owe an apology to Bryson because I was kind of counting him out of everything. <laughs> like, ah, eh, you know, these guys, no way, whatever. Man. Bryson, it was big hitters. Just poop came nah, out. No, dude. I mean. Everyone's going to be like, well, you're saying that now. But honestly, like, I mean, I've been following him a lot because he's blowing up on YouTube and all that shit. He does a lot Everywhere. of great content. And I mean, whether you like the live thing or not, I mean, it, he's putting out some really cool stuff and I've enjoyed watching him. And since I've gotten into it, I've just been like, dude, he is one of the best golfers right now. I mean, he he yeah. legitimately is. And I wish I, I think that was a big miss not having him on the Ryder Cup. Yeah, it really yeah, was, yeah, your comments man. getting a lot of love there. It's getting a lot yeah. of traction. I, I mean, I believe it too, man. I I think he's got such like, I don't know. He's got an aura around him when he plays. Just he's got like an energy to him, yeah, you know, yeah. the way he plays and stuff like that. And he's even said he like really puts it out there every round. Um, and that's kind of one thing that he's benefited from going over to live with a lighter schedule is he has more time to like rest because he does invest himself so much round around yeah. um but yeah i i just i think that was such a big miss man like take it back I three he to four years yeah he's improved <laughs> improved his game yeah. dramatically it's like uh you could talk about this or that but if you look back if you're steadily going up just like a great stock you're doing great you know it's like when you start when your game starts falling off he's only been going up getting better yeah, yeah which is crazy you know i mean I obviously the hit the ball too he loves yeah. the he loves the fans. He even said it when he was interviewed. He was like, "This is what we're here for, right? Like this is this is you know we're all about the fans." And I think that's yeah. different than a golfer saying like, "Oh, I'm here to win," or "I want to win," or champion mentality. You know, he's he's more like I think getting used to this live stuff where it's it's all like kind of arena golf and it's all the lights, it's the like lights everybody's are on. cheering and it's it's yeah. fun camaraderie and everybody's got it going. I, I think that that's kind of pay, playing into what he's talking about. It's like he's he's all about it for the fans now. So. I think it's uh, helping him in, in turn play better golf because he's getting fueled up or fired up or inspired or whatever it is. I mean, that that chip in eagle on 18 was like ridiculous with a six iron or yeah. whatever. Yeah. Like, dude, I mean, come on. It was ridiculous. He did the replay of like his five top shots on, on his Instagram and they were all dirty shots too. Yeah. yeah. They were just nice shots. I was like, damn, bro. It's like five mm. solid and he's just out, there like out. science. Yeah. Yeah. yeah, he caught one Texas wedge too, Sean. I don't know if you saw that that one Texas wedge he hit from out oh, a little yeah. bit. Come on, I was, I was like, that's that had your name all over. 
I mean, I can still beat anybody in the PGA. I stand by this, you know, in a Texas wedge off, like challenge me, you know, I'm out there. They don't want the smoke. You 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 were helping him out earlier uh, in the off season, right? Yeah. yeah, He came to training camp. He came to to Fox and Bob training training camp here in uh, Green Scott. Yeah. It was a, it was a butter churning, uh, butter churner week. Um, Speaking of which butter churning, Scotty Scheffler's court date postponed. I saw that. So he's already, you know, they're already doing the good, the good deeds of, uh, Giving him some time there to uh, to adjust, <laughs> dude. What an ankle monitor on. situation that was, man. Yeah, I'm so kidding. we're not news experts. We've all read the story, you know. Like it, it's clearly out there. We're not going to cover it like it's a news story. But basically, we all know what happened. Scotty had a miscommunication with the officer. Something happened, and all this drama unfolded. He got arrested. All he has all these charges. One's a felony. So he's got all this stuff now on him that he has to deal with. And then you got the whole golf world hating on uh, the police force there, like they're umpires at a baseball game. So then you have all this drama <laughs> unfolding in the golf world and the golf community. Then you got, you know, Scotty acting like a class act about it. He's like, you know, I, I love the, you know, the community. He's like taking photos with the cops and laughing and doing stuff. It's like, you know, hey, I like that he's good spirited about it and he can move on from it. Clearly, they're going to drop the charges. I would assume like, I don't know, that's my opinion. That's my like shot out of the dark opinion. If you ask me, maybe I don't know, like really, really going to give him charges a, for, a silent donation man, for, uh, yeah, you know, yeah maybe a silent dollars. donation to the city of louisville and <laughs> right, i think right, that's right i think that's what's going to happen i'll put really, 100 kids through college just just give me that yeah, there you go have <laughs> fun uh yeah i'm yeah for sure for sure the one thing that bothered me about it though is like when it first happened there was such like such noise and uh you know everyone was focused on scheffler and was like dude like someone died in a traffic accident yeah and yeah like, dude, i don't know i, I just crazy. like kind of hated the initial reaction that was like so much about scotty which like i get it you know it was a big yeah. story and it was wild but like you know there's just you know someone lost their life which is yeah it's tough. It's tough. I thought it was crazy. We talked how... about that so early. Point, nobody knew that. So when all of us covered it or were well, joking right. about it or whatever, yeah, on the no outside. one knew. Yeah, right. no one knew like what was going Speculative. on. Speculative. So yeah. Yeah. We all just thought like Scotty had a morning, like Tiger had a was morning. Get, yeah, yeah, yeah. He was out there like, you know, right. just lighting up in his <laughs> Range yeah. Rover. Yeah. Like, you know, like just pre-gaming. bumping Biggie, just like pre-gaming for the tournament. <laughs> just... Yeah. That's what I thought. He's just one of the boys. He's just one of the boys, bro. He He's rolled down his window. The smoke just, just bellows out. Just the officer's like, <laughs> up at L, you know, he's like, <laughs> oh, man. That's yeah, so man. Funny. So That's I, so I don't funny. know. Like, Scotty handled it, I think, well. And uh, I think at this, well, well, considering after, you know, handling everything in that situation after knowing what he knew after. Um, so, yeah, that, that was a crazy yeah. stage of events. That was great. I, I salute the kid who had made the t-shirt by the t-shirt time oh boy off. yeah he had the shirt bro, already made shout out to that kid whatever his name it was, was, that uh, was we salute insane. you <laughs> we salute. i went into work and i'm like man like i'm literally getting ready we're turning the grill on everything's on it's like 6 30 and like everybody's talking about this and i'm like i ain't even opened my eyes yet like, i start <laughs> looking and i'm like what in the world is going on i'm like yeah. and just picture like it just from Forest there going crazy. so like yeah it's o'clock. the biggest golf it news was, in years besides live you know i think that's that's Definitely the biggest headline for golf in a long Crazy. time. Crazy. Uh, maybe had to kill more too. That was a big headline. <laughs> Speaking of which, hey. shifting gears there, Adam Sandler wants to cast Tiger Woods. You saw that? That would be hilarious. Yeah. I did see that. I did see that. Uh, hey, I, I just hope it doesn't become like overblown. You know what I mean, sometimes yeah. they try to like fit so many different characters in there and it gets like. You know, it's a little they just ruin it. Yeah, 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 they ruin it. Yeah, yeah, and sometimes you got to have those characters that aren't big stars that are just kind of good pieces that nobody knows. You got to find right. that like talent that hasn't been just yeah. yet. Throw that guy in the movie. You got to have those little special pieces of just actors. Play it as it lies. <laughs> yeah, yeah, like that guy's random. Like, who the hell, what the Jaws, fuck was that guy? Ever? Jaws yeah. from the old yeah. Bond movies. <laughs> yeah, like. Oh god. Yeah, no, like these guys shit, are just dude. so random. You know, you gotta find those little gems out there to make a good movie. We think absolutely. Yo, speaking of gems, I mean I gotta give another shout out with the PGA championship to Fall Hall, man. That oh. that course was beautiful. Minutes. Oh, sure, man. Getting to experience like that Augusta quality. I mean, I mean it's different, different when you're different there. Courses, man. It's different they're when you're there. Courses. I just meant like like quality. It just looks so pristine and just quality. Oh, it was, and beautiful. It was, and it was and pure care of the rough was brutal dude it was just it was that tiered rough we talked about last yep. last week and yeah man i i got one picture 
<clears throat> when we first got there, got our spot on 13 first thing in the morning for all the morning marquee uh, groups going off 10. We got that 13, the signature hole with the waterfalls. I put my coffee cup so, down and the fucking rough was up to the lid. Like, <laughs> well, kind of lost the my drink over there the grass into the cup. Yeah, yeah. You must Dude, have went it, early, man, because you had some seats. Like, people were yeah, commenting yeah, on yeah. the videos being like, man, this guy had, like, good seats to the right to the 13th hole there. Yeah, well, I mean, we kind of scoped, you know, scoped it out the night before and, uh, you know, looked at who was teeing off when and saw that most of the marquee groups in the morning rounds were going off 10. So I was like, fuck, well, I already want to see that signature hole. Uh, you know, the Island Green, you got the limestone waterfalls. It's fucking beautiful, beautiful. Um, and I uh, kind of looked at the map, saw like a nice little spot where I figured they'd be trying to hit their tee shots and then hit that approach shot. So that mapping was on point. Yeah, <laughs> yeah, yeah, dude. Once we, we get a little recon, there, get the recon. Right, dude, you gotta, you gotta survey, <laughs> yeah. man. Yeah, yeah. That uh, makes but a once lot. we got there, man, at like six forty-five or so, you know, we hit the, the merchandise shop real, real quick. Got a little hat, got a you know polo, golf shirt. And then we headed out there, you know, I held down a spot on 13, Pops got some breakfast, brought it back. Nice. And then here we go, yeah. man, we got all those marquee groups. We got to see Tiger multiple holes because we just kept sk skipping ahead after, you know, a wave of different groups went through. It's tough. And Either you sit in one spot and you watch everyone go through it once or you move around. But it's like that chance, like, oh, you could miss a few people by going over here. So it's like, for sure, it depends but, who you're trying to catch. Yeah, right, yeah. right. But if you do kind of uh, look at who's teen off when and scope it out, you can get like good spots by seeing a few groups skipping ahead a few holes and then see that wave come through. And then what we did is after we saw all those marquee groups in the morning uh, go through, uh, we were able to catch up to all the afternoon marquee groups teeing off and coming back through the, uh, you know, one through 18. So, so it was we perfect saw Scotty setup. and all yeah. of them. Rom, you got it like, yeah, still a lot of walking, dope. getting your steps in, yeah, getting your steps dope, in. Dude, it was dope. And then we headed back to 18 for the last, you know, two hours and just got prime spot for all the groups coming in 18 and then, you know, Scotty finishing it up. And dude, that's where was, a power chair that, comes in clutch, you know? It was, oh, oh, yeah, 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 for sure. Well, that's the thing too. You bring your own chair, and we didn't do this, but you can bring your own chair, just post it up somewhere, and you know the yeah. expectation is no one touches it. You're so right. then you just walk around and then come back to your spot. But yeah, that's hey, dope. I got in play at one point. I got in play. Got to pull stake out the ground, put it down, <laughs> for take that, hit an eighteen green, man. Oh wow. my god. Hey, Four. There are there are a few times, <laughs> man. We got we got epic close ups to you know the boys in play and shit. So it, it was epic, man. It was a great course, great championship. You were there, um, man. You could smell the cologne experience. off those boys. It was yeah, yeah. <laughs> we were getting prime spots, man. We saw some that's epic cool. shots. That's super so, cool. PGA um, experience was great. Uh, apologies to the guy who DM'd us asking about parking situations for the PGA Championship. Us three idiots have a no idea, and b <laughs> um would have probably directed them to the website or something. C we lot, absolutely D level. <laughs> uh, Brendan could maybe enlighten uh, was, us. At the how expo, it man. <laughs> there's a there's a parking lot. I didn't see that DM, so my bad, brother. Um, <laughs> yeah, you know, hit me up. We'll, we'll go <laughs> hit a golf round somewhere. <laughs> uh, no, but. Uh, Dude, we lucked out. My my pops actually got the room for us, um, and he like it was booked out, and rooms were super expensive. And we just so happened random got a room uh, that was like really good cost. And we looked at the uh, the bus route the next morning, and we we're like plan planning that shit out. Um, and we realized, dude, we could walk there. It was right across <laughs> yeah. the street. So we ended up having like a prime spot as far as hotel. Like everything kept lining up for us it's better, all weekend, better. dude. Yeah, I mean, I, like literally beyond the parking, which was at the expo, and then they drove you uh, on the buses and then brought you back, dropped you off, and that was pretty efficient shit too. Yeah. Um, but dude, beyond that, you know, we went Friday, the, you know, after we had seen Valhalla on the, on Thursday, we went and played Stone Lake and, uh, we woke up, it rained the whole drive from Louisville to Cincinnati. It was, it was supposed to be rainy in Cincinnati. As soon as we got to Stone Lake, 
stopped raining, played 18. Dude, it was dope. Couldn't ask what for a weekend, you shot man. a 64? Yeah. Jeez. I shot an 85, I believe. Ooh. 85, 86. I, I believe Brisk. it was 85. We'll give you, we'll give you um, an 85. But, dude, I hit the ball really well, uh, especially iron-wise, wedge-wise. I putted really well. Uh, the pops, I got to shout them out. He hold, hold out a little chip in on one. Uh, nice starting to start an sick. gamer i i will say i was i was going down and it was an elevated green and i was chipping up from the backside uh and i didn't see it all i heard was <laughs> <laughs> that was and, a great uh, if you know brendan's dad that was perfect that was a perfect <laughs> impression <laughs> And I'm like, dude, I didn't see it. Doesn't count. <laughs> He's like, no oh, shit. Oh god, like high school at the lunch table. Like, no, I didn't see that trick, dude. No, you gotta do it again. Do it again. <laughs> oh shit, but dude, yeah. So he chips in, and then yo, I kid you not, on on eight, he's 65 yards out. I'm getting ready to chip. He hits one perfect onto the green, rolls out, and goes in again, dude. He holds oh, out from 65. What? Dude, the gamer's on fire. Unreal. Has he been? He's been listening to Good Lives Golf. I think that's what's been of on. Of course, his game. of course, of course. And beyond that, he's walking to the cart. No need to go putt. <laughs> Quap, I chip, rolls out, goes in. Did we both hold out on the same oh, hole? God. It was unbelievable. Oh. It, we, I call what? that the coxman. Two balls the in the hole, man. <laughs> <You do. laughs> he's a coxman, <laughs> dude. That's insane. It was fucking. Um, it was. It was. Wow. I'm telling you, the Talk whole about father just kept moment, lining up, moment. dude. I think the back to back runs and uh, it was awesome. Father and son, that, that's crazy. That's got to be a record yep. somewhere in some capacity. Guinness Book of World Records should call it <laughs> some, some of a record. Uh, it was it was a great great weekend. But hey, I was humbled. I was humbled. I thought my game was feeling good. I went eighty six and then I went eighty five. Both at Stone Lake Tough Course. Went to Elks Run feeling like I was about to just light it up. You know, I found it. I found it, boys. <laughs> wow. No, no, ninety nine. That's the way. It goes. <laughs> oh, it's so brutal, you got man. two. You you went to the PGA Championship and golf two rounds. My God. Yeah, yeah. I have a really nice Out wife. There. I got a really, yeah, really nice. Really nice. Holy nice. shit, yeah. man! Dude, Shut planned up. it out to a T. <laughs> yeah, he's got this. No waste of time. Scientifically figured out here. Oh right? man, no, dude. I you know, like I said, everything lined up. Yeah, that, that sounds amazing. Sounds like paradise. Sounds like a beautiful week. It was great, man. I was humbled. I was humbled, but I got to get back out there. I think it was just a really big mental day. You know, I just struggled with my mentals. You know, game got away from me, and I think I got a little too armsy now that I think back on it, you know, but it was ha hard to recognize, you know, what I moment. played. Yeah, exactly. in the moment. Well, so, uh, Hopefully that's the fix, and it was just a little thing, and I got to just, you know, quiet the mind. And Summer's not even here yet. It's, that's, hey. that's the crazy part. It's not even hey. really here yet. You got to get ready, too. When I come into town in about a week and a half, we're going to be playing at least a round. So, oh, yeah. You know, I, I was uh, thinking about it, too, man. I'm battle. playing that <laughs> shit out, man. We're going to have, have a nice little battle here, so gear up. I'm going to beat that ass. Get your money ready. Get An your pockets right. Anthony... Uh, <laughs> Anthony and me already had a nice little round there, and uh, yeah, we got after it. it was good. We got great after day, it. beautiful day. Yeah, yeah. Where I'm at? pumped to go back. I'm pumped to go back to work. I placed uh, third in that that huge tourney. That was I saw that. Yeah, yeah. good shout out to 170 the boys. dudes, bro. I'm, a, I'm going out. back. Let's to work. go, dude. Ah, who Mr. wants so? you and Mr. Russ Proof <laughs> over there getting yeah. it, at, getting after it. Getting after it. Yeah, what was dope. your first big purchase, man? <laughs> what did you buy? <laughs> New driver? What did what you was eat that? after you won? <laughs> yeah, I want to start asking those stupid post-game interview questions at big tournaments. I gotta we gotta get those press passes going on. Shout out to our new developments going on. We got good lives golf going to the Ryder Cup. I'm saying it. We're announcing That's it. Pumped. It's official. That's pumped. We're going. It's speak this into existence go, yeah hey that's a long ways away but it's it's not that you know, far it's close enough <laughs> like a year you know i'm excited hey. that's dope Box ticket. So one is better, is better than none one is better than none you got to start somewhere that's page black it's the gorgeous course <laughs> of the long island wait. strong island Who, baby who's who's a couple early guys you'd like to see on that on that team mm. i want to see a mix man I want to see I, yeah, yeah. some live players. 
Yeah, you know what I'm saying? I don't. Okay, yeah, 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 I want to see a mixture. I don't want to see. I think Bry- Bryson got to be there. I just feel gotta like be he's there. and the viewership like that's too. His style. He's getting yeah. he's getting those views, like you said too. People are they're all paying attention to him. You know, it's yeah. He's just got that that like you said that energy that aura. It's around him right now. Yeah. Yeah, man, there's big events, guys. I'm thinking like we got the Olympics coming up. We Shoffley, still have some, Scheffler. Some I mean, I don't see how USA is losing this year. They got heat. yeah, no, no. USA's no got heat. I don't see the US losing. Oh, we I got mean, talent, man. Victor Hovland about the has right turned guys. it on. Victor Hovland, we'll talk about it, man. Victor Hovland's turned it on lately. You saw that. Well, it's always Billy putting. Ho. It's always putting in Billy, Billy Ho events, out man. there. Billy Ho, Billy my guy. Hey, everybody's don't playing sleep. with my guy. Now Don't he plays sleep. top 10 major. Now he's fucking Don't exempt sleep. from shit. He's like got privileges now. He gets free breakfast at the Hilton buffet every on, day for the rest of his life. He's set. He's really set. Up. Yeah. The whole set. family. This All course could kids. set up this week for him. Yeah. He's out he here hungry too. Someone to look at. The guy's a machine. He's just a machine. You know, he, he puts in the work consistently. Puts over in the that years. work. He's a yeah. grinder. He's a grinder. Kevin he is, dude. He's a Garudin grinder. Gotcha. <laughs> you're a winner rocky you're a winner well scotty might have to come back win. might have to come back and uh show these boys you know he took that jail week off <laughs> so is, is it like bad boys for life's playing in the background he's just gonna like walk into the <laughs> the, the tournament just bam 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 dude bam, prison bam, mike bam, was too bam, damn bam, funny bam. dude dude yeah, the prison All mic thing, hours I came it. off quick with that. It was literally the second I saw, I read the text. I think it was like six minutes after Golf Digest posted uh, that Scotty had been arrested for something. I immediately, the first image I had in my head was prison mic from the office. And I was like, this has to be what I, what I mix this year. It was too funny. I was on it quick. I posted it probably quick. within 10 minutes of that shit being posted. So you live in an on demand world, man. You got to be fast <laughs> with that stuff. You gotta well, be it's quick. easy when you run 10 accounts for Instagram. So you can just, I'm always on it. I'm obsessively on it. So it's, I, it's all easy to see new things when I'm always on it. It's, I have, and I follow mutual accounts on multiple accounts. So it's like you, you, you always get news feed, basically. Oh, Talk about a machine. Talk about a machine. <laughs> yeah, it's not a great, uh, it's not a great day, a great life, but it's, uh, it's not a great life. lifestyle. Yeah, definitely not good on my eyes. However, no. segueing in, this at week, least you don't get a sunburn. Another we big have week. another big week coming up because everybody sleeps on this Charles Schwab, but it's a big one, man. People play, they show up to play. People get you know antsy after the majors, like they don't want to. They don't want to be bummed out if they had a really bad major. Like some of these guys didn't play that well, and bigger names. I'm not going to mention any names and embarrass them, but some big guys did not play very well last week, and I think. They want to come back and be like, hey, you know what? I can still play golf. Fuck you guys. Because they get some shit in the press or the media. And I think that's real. Um, so I don't know. Who's a redemption player this week, Sherm? Redemption player? Top redemption player. Adam Scott for me. <laughs> I like that. If, if you want top, top redemption player, I'm going Wesley Bryant. But if you want like regular <laughs> redemption player, let me get a Tony Fee now. Let me get a Tony okay. Tuna. Like that's Tony you know. Tuna. Let me get a Tony Tuna out there. I think he's a solid, solid call for this week. I think he's uh, kind of built built out for this, and he's been playing well, and he's uh, enjoying himself out there. He's fresh, and the Texas course, little uh, humidity never hurt nobody. I think he'll be fine. I don't think he uh, is bothered in that condition. No, so I think no, he's fine. he shouldn't be. This isn't uh, Alaska golf. I think he'll be all right. You know what I mean? He'll be all right. <laughs> I think he'll be all right. He's not playing golf in Iceland, all right? Yeah, I think He's he'll be all right well. this week. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> uh, that was oh, mad man. funny, dude. Oh, but man. I, I like I Siwoo know. Kim. I like a yep. couple guys. You know, I like a Siwoo Kim. Um, honestly, and we don't talk about him enough lately. Sun JM, too. He could come and have a week. I think hot, those two dude. guys together... That's He's a hot. scary duo to watch. So hot right now. Yeah. And, I thought uh, I, I don't see Ricky Fowler in there this week either. I'm a little. Yeah. What are you going to do, man? Oh, well, man. there wasn't any orange outfits left, I think. So he couldn't. Um... <laughs> oh, Scott Abe's wearing it. Yeah. <laughs> Too soon. Too soon. <laughs> so, Brendan, Scotty are had that with, what, what are you thinking this week, Brendan? What's your moves? Are you going, are you going Olive Branch for Akshay or what, what are you picking? How are you picking? 
I think, I mean, I think he could have a, a good week this week. I, mean, I like Akshay. I saw him playing out there too. I, I, I saw him on a couple holes. Um, oh, I don't know, dude. I mean, you know, I, I like Christian Beesenhood. I've talked about him before. He's a good little approach player. He can get hot with the putter, but, um, Plus you know, 4, Doug, on the odds there. I do yeah. think Doug could be a guy to look at. I think Doug game could play well. Yeah. Um, but Shut honestly, up. I think at the end of the day, I mean, this is just the Scotty tournament again. Scotty, Adi, Adi. I mean, it's tough to try to defer from that. Dude, yeah. Man. And, until we see like something with this game become like consistent, you know, you know, if we start seeing his putter fall off for a couple of tournaments in a row, okay, sure. You know, I'll start looking elsewhere, but yeah, it's just does. too damn good, dude. Tiger the odds are ridiculous. On, I mean, the, yeah. the odds on Scheffler are 280. Plus two eighty, yeah. and the and the next in the field is Morikawa, and that's plus twelve hundred. So that's yeah. the insanity of difference. I like I Colin. Think, I like Colin's odds as well this week too. Man. I was gonna say if I'm gonna pick a solid winner that's not a sleeper, it's Colin Morikawa this or week. Or top five. If I'm not gonna pick Scotty, um, but like Brendan said, <clears> he's <throat> a machine, and I think that's just what it's been. It's it's been like a, a constant, just pump out of good golf, and he had one bogey round. Like holy crap, you know the whole world was shook. But I just yeah. I think he shot the 66 yeah. with the jail day, which is like ridiculous. Insane. Insane. I'm telling people now they do you understand how like to deal with all of that and then to go out and, and, and shoot low? Like to me, it's it's he's unbothered by any of this stuff, which is crazy. <clears throat> it's it's yeah. mind blowing. Yeah. If I go to jail, I'm like, I'm shooting 105 on the first nine. <laughs> I'm like, I'm <laughs> you're still drinking high down. the second you get out yeah. of there. Yeah, of course, bro. Are you kidding me? Yeah, it's like yeah. all that, all the all the cameras, people are talking, all the the crowd, everything was going crazy. It had to be weird playing. Like just picture <laughs> just playing that after all that it had to be weird. Yeah. Seeing the guy with your shirt on with the that had to have been weird. That's too. what I mean. Like him and Tiger are now in an elite class amongst themselves <laughs> of guys who have seen their mugshot on a shirt <laughs> the day of the tournament and laughed oh, about elite. it. Like oh, that's God. it's hysterical to me. But yeah, he's gonna go out there. Yeah, yeah. he's gonna put a wild event, man. Wow. Yeah, so and you were there great. and you were locked in there. And, How crazy. And Colonial is not an easy club this week, man. It's it's a it's a hard course. Par 70, 7,289 yards. Um it's it's tough. It's it's not like some easy thing right after a major to come kind of set you back into something. Uh my last thought on this tournament and my picks are my super sleeper for the week, JJ Spawn. Going JJ Spawn, super sleeper. He's my sleeper cell here. Um, so that's my guy to watch. Put a little, you know, key Sean on the side, little psh, psh, something, you know, $2 of Monopoly. $2. Yeah, Monopoly. Hey, we, know he, we know he likes Texas golf. We know he does, and that's why I'm picking him. So that's, I bet that's you where Cooch, I'm going. Coocher, I bet you Cooch does better than Cooch. Spawn this week. Cooch wow. loves a little Texas <laughs> golf. <laughs> Now nah, we're talking about some dogs, man. That's a long time. Well, I'm sticking, too, I'm think, sticking you know. with my, my Tony Tuna winner, but I like the JJ Spawn sleeper. And I'm I'm not dogging Scotty. I just I want to be different and not pick Scotty because I know you both oh, will course. pick Scotty. So, you already know. Brennan, your winner. What is it? Before we uh, I, I gotta go, Scotty. Gotta go, Scotty. Have to. But yo, before Petty uh does his, did you guys see and I gotta give a shout out because it was fucking epic. Toasty. Did you see Toasty oh drive God. the green yeah. on 13? I mean, Damn. I get it. You know, when the leader is 15 <laughs> under and you're plus three, just go for it. But Mashed that potatoes. was unbelievable. Onto an island green with the driver into like five or eight feet and knocks down the bird. Looking like, like me out there, great. basically. <laughs> Looking like me out there. <laughs> He's the only guy that went for it all week, which is awesome, too. Driver off the deck, baby. That's how you roll. No, he t. No, it's a t. No, I'm dude. joking. I'm joking. You're yeah. nuts. You're nuts, <laughs> Sherm. <laughs> I'm saying that's how I would go. PGA D Tour. D I mean, driver off the deck, no matter what situation. Are you kidding me? In the fairway, 270 oh, yards out. Yeah, give me that driver. Let's go. Give me Don't make a three wood. <laughs> Even though I probably break oh, it, and then I wouldn't oh, be able to play oh, the rest of the oh, tournament. Oh god. <laughs> <laughs> yeah. Anyways, man, Petty, who we got, man? Who we got? I'm top. I like Scotty taking it myself. Even if I'm gonna be safe, I'm just I put him at top five. And then for the top twenty, I think I like both Adams. I like uh, Scott and Shank. I like both of those guys coming in, okay. placing top twenty. Ooh. Clean. Sometimes you just gotta play it safe, man. And, and you know, like uh, those guys are 
pretty much always going to make their way to the top 20, I think, easily. So. A Scheffler minus uh, 140 for the top 10, minus 250 for the top five. So, my sleeper he's that good. He's I'll that give, good. I'll give a little sleeper shout out then to, to Hoagie, dude. I feel like Hoagie's just Tom, you know. He just he's he's sitting around, around. A plus four thousand, so you could get a little value there with some hoagies. Yes, if you like hoagies, he's your guy. He's he's your guy. <laughs> right. Yeah, that dude. A lot, a lot of comp out there. A lot of competition in that field this week too. Really. Ooh, it can get spicy. Yeah, it gets <laughs> spicy. A lot of competition. It really could. Bring yeah, your A game. Bring that A game. Yeah, man. <laughs> All right, boys. That's well, it. Be safe, it man. Let's see, let's see who makes it another to the top. episode. See you guys yes, next week. Enjoy Take the golf. Easy, boys. We'll get out there, and uh, I'll see you there. Shrap. Keep killing it.